Hello and welcome back to another future Doghouse production. Let's talk about the new flu medicine that's been released. All right, it's called Baloxavir. I'm probably mispronouncing it, but uh, Baloxavir uh, Marboxil, okay? And this one is a new mechanism of action compared to the older drug, the older flu medicine, which is uh, Oseltamivir, okay? And uh, Xanamivir. Now, Baloxavir has a new mechanism of action. It's a cap-dependent endonuclease inhibitor. Okay, ooh, big words. You're a medical student, you should know this. All right, so when someone asks you, a patient asks you, um, okay, I've got the flu and there's this new flu medicine, now you can explain to them what it does. Here's a flu virus, here's your cell, okay? The flu attaches to the cell, uh, the uh, RNA, DNA exchanges in the cell, okay? And it has to go through an mRNA synthesis before it can get translated into new flu viruses. Now, this mRNA, mRNA synthesis requires a cap-dependent endonuclease. Now, if you block the cap-dependent endonuclease or inhibit it from the, uh, from the flu virus creating, uh, you know, basically uh, a, a replicating itself through the mRNA synthesis, then you, you prevent the flu virus from multiplying, from spreading, okay, uh, at, the, uh, at the cellular level. Now, what the older drugs do is it's a neura, neura mini, nah, neuraminidase inhibitor. Now, the neuraminidase happens at the later stage after the virus has replicated and needs to be released back into uh, the body or the body fluids. Um, it requires the neuraminidase to release it or break the uh, cell membrane so that it can be released into uh, into your body system. So that's the difference between uh, these two drugs. So there you have it. If you like this video and you want more of these videos, please click subscribe. Thank you and have a nice day. You study medicine. Books after books after books of knowledge gets processed. But can you memorize all this knowledge? After many interviews with students, the solution was simple and was created. QP.com. Practice your medical knowledge.